it. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was terrible. Hey guys, what's up? It's Underverse here and welcome to Four Block Dungeon. Have you ever thought, like, have you ever played a dungeon crawler and thought, hmm, you know what this needs? Tetris. <laughs> That's what this game is. Uh, basically, apparently it's like Tetris and you build the dungeon based off the pieces and it's really cool. But I think I, I, I'd, like, I should show you so you could get it, you know? It also, because I, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Great intro. 10 out of 10, yep. Oh, shit. Hold on, hold on. Hey, hey, can we, yeah, can we pause? Yeah, we need it, we need a slow. <laughs> oh, shit, son. This is gonna be rough. Oh, no. Wait, okay, there, there we go. Hey, <laughs> oh, fuck. Wait, hold on, wait. Why is it not moving? It's not moving now. What? What? Hey, 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 hey! <laughs> Why is it not moving? Why can I, can I not move? You know what? Just, just gonna let this happen. <laughs> no, what's going on? Wait, what is this? What's this? This little nod. What's this little nodule? <laughs> what is this? Let's restart. Uh, you know, I was just showing off uh, mechanics. <laughs> so how do I become a boy? I still don't know how to become a boy. I understand everything else, but I don't understand how to become a boy. Oh, yeah. Oh. Mm. I mean, I can rotate it. Look, I'm ro rotating, baby. <laughs> oh, it does. Oh, I think I glitched out the game because it doesn't look like I'm moving up there, am I? <laughs> Oh, oh, it doesn't move as long as I'm rotating it, I see. Oh, oh, wait, hold on. What weird fucking controls? Wait, wait, ah! Oh, 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 I see, I figured out games. It's like a, that's like a hallway. <laughs> what the fuck? You know what? This feels good. You know what? Let's just make a log. Yeah, this feels about right. <sighs> I played Tetris before. <laughs> now I want to see when I become a boy. What what will happen when I come into this world? Like, wh what is this gonna look like? Kind of just want to get to the top and see if that makes me become a boy, a real man. Am I a real boy now? No. Oh, wait. There's like spinning up there. Oh, is that where I'm gonna pop out? If I if I about Fortnite drop. <laughs> Hello. Holy shit. I think I'm, hold on, give me a second. Okay, wait, hold on, hold on, pause. Wait, hold on, hold on. I'm that little fucker down there, what the fuck? <laughs> How was I supposed to see that? Oh my God, he's so small, oh God. This game insults me, you know how many times a day I have to hear that? <laughs> Let's bring back old memories, man. Why? <laughs> Why am I so small? I'm such a small boy. I thought I'd be able to like pause time and then explore the dungeon, but you do it at the same time. Holy shit. There's no way you're like there. I don't know. There's no human being on earth that can multitask. Basically, whenever you multitask, you're not really multitasking per se. You're just switching your brain to do different objectives in rapid succession which technically isn't good for the brain and technically makes you less efficient at doing whatever task you're actually doing because you're not focusing down on it so in all actuality when people multitask they're not really multitasking that would be a lie bam get your get your life ruined kid like for example i remember later or a while ago i was talking about like how a threesome not in this video i was talking about in, in another video like in a threesome basically like you're not you're not really you're not really doing you're not really multitasking in that you're like you're like sucking someone <laughs> you're like licking the clitoris and then getting yourself sucked and trying not to come <laughs> all in that all in that full swift so you're like you're like you're like switching between the two you know <laughs> if you know what i mean it's early in the morning okay <laughs> you know what i'm just playing tetris at this point i'm not even playing the actual game i mean but it's just so it seems so scary too like if i'm honest with you like i don't there's no there's no there's no incentive like it's not like sonic where like you know you know the incentive to play sonic games is to is to see how bad sonic team has made another sonic team game again see now see now i'm playing See, now that I finished the dungeon, now I can actually play. Hmm, see, it feels much easier. This is a really tough concept. My goodness. I like it, but it, it's, I like, 
always like the whole, oh yeah, you can build the dungeon whatever way you want type, type, type of games. There's been a couple of them recently. Um, like one from Mush, which is a game developer. I know it sounds like a sex product. <laughs> Ooh, mush. Oh, that sounds... Now, I don't know if I would want that sex product. <laughs> it's like if Viagra was called, like, Dick Buster. <laughs> I don't know. That kind of makes it more intense, so maybe I would want it more. Dude, did Harry get with anybody at the end of Harry Potter? I always wanted it to be Hermione, but it's not Hermione. It's, like, an old man. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, wait, no, that was a porn parody. <laughs> oh, sorry, I get them confused all the time. Because they're pretty much the same. <laughs> I've never watched any of the Harry Potters, really. I watched, like, the first and last one, and that's about it. Because I wasn't really... It's not that I wasn't interested with the series. It's just, like, meh. Meh. The only Harry I like looking up is, like, in Pornhub. <laughs> or, like, XX videos, like, where I'm, like... Or Brazers, I guess. <laughs> if you're a snob. I'm not gonna, like... It's so... I don't know. I, I really don't want to... Like, it's really hard to do this and that at the same time. Like, I don't want to do it. Like, I, I'm very... <laughs> it's scary! It's scary to want to move around and build this, build this thing at the same time. And then also the game's so far away from me that it looks like I'm playing, like, on my Game Boy in the sunlight. <laughs> you guys remember that? Jesus Christ, that sucked. <laughs> it's like, dick. You could never see anything. You'd be like, you'd have to squint, and then your eyes would get worse, and then your mom would be like, don't squint, honey. Your eyes are gonna get worse. <laughs> you'd be like, mom, I'm playing Pokemon Red. Man, I'm trying to beat the Elite Four. So now I'm moving, if you can't tell. You might not be able to see, but right now I'm actually moving around in the dungeon. I do, I will say, I really do like the fact that the dungeon connects to each other, because this could have easily been like a thing where like, you'd make paths that don't connect to each other and due to that you kind of artificially soft lock the player but instead they didn't do that which is really cool there's there are pits that kind of make it where you can't get to things but that's okay i think you can always get to the exit and i just lied to myself <laughs> i just lied to myself i soft locked no no all my good fortune just went out the window this game's shit oh minecraft oh minecraft's so good Oh, yeah, get me out of here. Oh, get suck me in, baby. Oh, yes, the journey continues. Okay, you know what? This game's too easy. <laughs> it's too easy for a pro like me, so you know what I'm going to do? Oh, fuck, hold on. I forgot the controls. Okay, wait, hold on. Forgot the controls. Hey, there we go. I'm back in the game, baby. Okay, so I'm going to play this real seriously. Like, I'm I'm in eSports. It's in the game. Um, uh, I don't... See, again, it's so far away that I can't tell what that is. I'm gonna guess it's just like a corridor room. Yeah, and that's a coin there, so I can I can put a coin here. Oh, I meant to do that, clearly. Uh, there's another one of these blocks. Let me just put this over here. Oh, there's another one of these blocks. Let me just put this. <laughs> Why? Stop giving me those blocks, damn it. They suck. I want someone to go into that tight little hole over there where my character is. Oh, so when you're moving, the thing doesn't move either. Okay. Oh, it moves on its own timer if... No, never mind. I, I don't know. I don't know what that little circle thing is. I'm going to guess that's life. You know, that's that's telling me the life continuum there. Man, I feel whimsical. I feel like I'm about to get, I'm about to get Harry Potter. <laughs> Whatever that means. That needs to be like a sexual thing. Like, <laughs> hey, did you know Jimmy got Harry Potter last night? It's like Cleveland Steamer, but... <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's exactly what it is. It's a Cleveland steamer, but it's with someone with a swampy butthole. <laughs> oh, yes. Mmm, a welcome, <laughs> a welcome change. No, don't tell me I'm stuck. I think I'm stuck. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, shit, we gotta try again. Okay, I kind of got into the groove of this game. I really like... Like, now that I've actually interacted with it, I see that the game... <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm so good at the game. I mean, I meant to... <laughs> Clearly, <laughs> by my surprise nature, I was just, you know, hamming it up for the camera. I wasn't really surprised that it went down really fast. <laughs> oh, but no. Um, I really... Now that I've, I'm interacting with the systems, I do think that the game slows down, or at least slows down the flocks, or stops them from moving when you move. 
most of the time. So it's like kind of weirdly like either or. Like if the player's not moving, then the balls, the, the ball, the, I got balls on the mind. These clearly aren't balls, but the blocks move down. So yeah, that's interesting. There we go. Okay, come back. Oh no, <laughs> no, I want that to connect up so bad. I'm stuck in this fucking room. <laughs> oh no, no. I was like, hmm, this is going to be my last try. <laughs> Oh wait, hold on. If I can get like a long, long, mm, <laughs> a long piece in there, in that tight little crevasse, <laughs> it'll all be better. Oh, by the way, how's you guys' day? I hope that it's minty clean. Like, <laughs> like my butthole. <laughs> Ladies, <laughs> you know. <laughs> oh, fuck. Dude, I'm stuck in this hole. <laughs> no. Oh man, I'm like, I'm like, um, what's a, what's a Harry Potter character? I'm like, I'm like her no, Ron. <laughs> Why is he in a hole? I don't know, man. I mean, the fanfic I wrecked. <laughs> I, I wrecked. I wrecked. I read he was in a hole. Don't ask me why he was in a hole. Just know that, uh, Harry was there and Harry was doing some unsavory things. <laughs> things that were totally in his character. Fuck. Uh, especially according to, um, what's her name? J, 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 Wentworth. <laughs> I ate some, ah, oh, fuck. J, J, uh, no, her name's, I was about to say J, J, Abrams. No, her name's, um, J, K, Rowling, you know, cause she's a joke. <laughs> I don't know. She just very, she's weird. She's a very, uh, from what I've heard, I, I didn't like her in the first place. I didn't even like Harry Potter. <laughs> So you know what? I I like JK Rowling because before the internet thought she was weird. Okay, so beat that internet. Ooh, I'm I'm so hip. So cool. Bam, you're dead. I'm going to I'm going to use your bones on my butt. <laughs> Why? Cuz I'm constipated. <laughs> oh, no. No, that's rough. I need to focus on the Tetris bit for a moment. There's like no level where I can actually make a line if I wanted to. This was a lost cause before I even started, wasn't it? <laughs> Fuck. I didn't mean for that one to go down. Connect. No! <laughs> no, it's so fast! Come on. Come on. I promise. I promise. Maybe, maybe just stick it in. <laughs> now that looks... Oh, now that looks sensual. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, yeah. Oh. Man, I can make any game sensual. I'm making blocks. I'm making Tetris sensual. Uh, I mean, it, it was pretty essential to begin with. Get in the hole, get the get the dick-shaped blocks in a hole. There's like there's like none of these dicks that aren't block-shaped. At one point or another, some person's dick has looked like one of these blocks. <laughs> yeah, I'm I, I'm including I'm including I'm including that one weird shaped block that goes down two spaces and then up two spaces. <laughs> Someone's penis has looked like that before. If I just rotate them, they can't move. That's like that's like a, a cheat that I found. It's like a system. Oh yeah, beat that game. I don't, <laughs> I don't have to play by your rules. What? Oh <laughs> no, I wasn't paying, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> okay, this is my very last try. You know, I've, I've, I, I, oh wait, hold on, hold, hold on. Can I, can I do like a narrative first? Can we get in? Can I get in? Can I get it in? <laughs> the answer is yes. I can all, ah, always get it in. Ooh, oh, slide it in. <laughs> oh, yes, slide that in. Mm. Like a White Castle slider. <laughs> I don't know, food's on my mind right now. It's probably because I haven't ate breakfast yet, but, you know, that's okay. After, after this. <laughs> well, I'm gonna eat breakfast now. Mmm, can't wait. Shit. So, guys, that was Four Block Dungeon. Now, I, like originally like before i started and i was as i was getting my foot in i was like oh man maybe maybe this is kind of weird I, I didn't like uh originally i didn't like the whole oh you gotta you gotta put the tetris blocks down and you gotta move at the same time and then also i felt like the screen was really far away but i really think i got into my stride nearing the end of the video before you know after <laughs> Oh fuck me. The concept itself is really fun. I, I, I like the fact that I can build up this this dungeon of my very own customization and that I can kind of pick and choose what items are close to me. I wasn't really doing that that much in the video, but 
that's kind of because of the fact the idea I mentioned before the even though I, I got into the game you know I, I got very engaged with it and I started being able to move around while even placing blocks because there's a kind of sort of pause time I don't know how that works still the fact that it's so fucking far away you need a micro my my a microscope yeah you could use a micro i was i was thinking of a, a magnifying glass but we'll say a microscope sure you got to put your computer to monitor computer to computer monitor under a microscope to see it and it's just really difficult to know what's there and what's not there what items there are the only items i could really see were like the giant ass yellow coins and sometimes the potions and the skeletons but you know even then it's just it was just so far away it was kind of uncomfortable and then even then uh, another problem i have with the game is that line mechanic as as much as it was funny that i died at the end there i still think it was a, a quite annoying that uh, that happens i mean in tetris whenever you complete a line you're supposed to be rewarded i should instead of it killing me i should be rewarded with that and the whole line should not disappear but more so clear out all enemies in that line so i can kind of have total control over that line it's still beneficial to me it shouldn't punish me for playing tetris which the game is like it makes no sense and then going off of that i i think like the the rpg mechanics are kind of arbitrary i didn't really feel like i was getting buff and swole i mean i had health but you know i didn't i didn't really die that i died like once or twice from skeletons but that's about it because i just kept punching them in their face and just being swoller man showing off my guns you know <laughs> uh i call this one righty and i call this one hefty yeah <laughs> why do i not just call the left one actually i call the left one righty and i call the right one hefty oh did i confuse you there yeah i did <laughs> i can i almost combuzzled myself and i think if they shored up on a couple of mechanics if they focused on developing the the game like tetris like you know how it looks then it would be a lot better i mean like currently the game's in this state where like okay imagine for a second you're playing jenga you're playing jenga on whatever and in this jenga game if you remove a piece just if you remove a piece not even if you put it back on top not even if you put it on the ground whatever or not even if you make the tower collapse whenever you pull out a piece in general you lose a, you lose some health that's what this game is like right now and i don't like it i mean i, I think i would rather ha I, I, again i said before i think it would be cool if like the whole entire line was cleared out of enemies like the entire line that you made but i also think the tetris like gameplay should be kind of be linked back to the rpg gameplay they're two gameplay systems that are entirely detached from each other so instead what should happen is if you make a line you should perhaps get like a level up or maybe some exp or maybe some health something make it rewarding not not detrimental to my progress because i'm playing tetris <laughs> i i don't know why that's a thing and then also, I think if they focused down on making it where you could actually see the characters and items by either making them have outlines or some kind of glow, or maybe even a little map that zooms specifically in on the player to a certain extent, this game could be really cool. Anyways, guys, that was 4 Block Dungeon. Tell me what you guys think about 4 Block Dungeon in the comment section below. Hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you guys have a wonderful day. And I love you guys sincerely. This is Adair. I'll see you sexy later. Bye-bye.